alien life. Younger people. Moss, Uranus, maybe. Math and science, but also adventure. Mainly just plasma. The stars that await me. Hi, this is John from When We Were Apollo. I'm here at the Griffith Observatory in Los Angeles, and we're here to ask people their thoughts about space exploration. Do you think it's important to explore space? Yes. Why? Because I want to know if there's other people out there besides us. Okay. And I think we should be a no a knowledgeable about what's around us. You never know if there's like more stuff out there, new stuff. Hay que buscar un planeta donde las condiciones eh, atmosféricas, climáticas, puedan ser eh, similares a las de la Tierra. Why are you here at the Griffith Observatory? I was just bored of the house, so we just wanted to go out, and have some fun. Do you guys do you guys think exploring space is important? Yes. Why? Uh, because there's more discoveries that you can make every time like you go out into space and actually well. <laughs> Do you think it's important to explore the universe? I do. What do you guys think? I, mean, I think you should probably focus on world issues first. Okay, like what? I don't know, poverty, supply. Uh, to me it's not a priority because I have so many things to do. Like what? Like I have to do groceries for home, my wife is waiting for that. We've got problems here, you know people talk about colonizing other planets when we kind of should fix this one first. People are not so excited anymore about um, traveling. Why not? Don't know, it was very exciting in the 60s. What could we do today that would be as exciting as landing on the moon was in the 60s? The next big thing is like a space travel, like Virgin Atlantic and like SpaceX with Elon Musk and stuff. Well, I've been hearing a lot of rumors about Mars. I also know that no woman has stepped foot on the moon, and that is a problem. What do you think we should explore next? Uh, all the new planets that they've been finding out. I think I heard somewhere that they may film one or two other planets that could be habitable just in case something happens to ours. Yeah, definitely. I mean, Star Trek has to happen someday, right? <laughs> if we are going to mess up the planet in the ozone layer, um, is there some place else that we might have to go to? A lot of other planets are further away than the moon are, so I think we would have to like have younger people go instead of older people because older people, like by the time they would get to another planet, they would, would yeah. They would they <laughs> they wouldn't live long enough <laughs> yeah. to make it there. Yeah. <laughs> I hear for Mars exploration, they need a lot of young astronauts. Are you interested? Uh, I don't know. Think it over. Thanks very much. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Thank you guys. You're welcome. Enjoy your trip. You're Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Yep. Bye, Tom. Exploration will always be important, and you never know what you're going to discover out there.